Helix. Do you believe that the great Clayton Christensen, right and prescient about so many things, was potentially wrong about online education? Well, it's a complicated question, and I'm going to give a complicated answer, because while he predicted the demise of, I think, half of all schools, that they would go tumbling down the hill and that they would be replaced entirely by online schools, that didn't come to pass. Why hasn't online education helped to rapidly escalate this consolidation of higher ed? The conventional schools, which occupy now probably three quarters of higher education, they're still on ground, on campus, doing their traditional things. I think what's happened is that the digital incursion has made those schools stronger. It has given them other revenue streams and given them other opportunities and possibilities for older working students who can't go to the campus. So the online piece has been in part the savior of higher education and also a benefit, especially for working students.